Good morning. It is Monday, I think it's June the 3rd. And I got up about uh, 6 a.m., had a nice shower at the motel. Got the bike packed and uh, asked the people at the motel where I can get a good traditional breakfast. They recommended the Moab Diner, about eight blocks south on Main Street. Stopped in here, had a wonderful cup of coffee, and I hit a new milestone for breakfast. I had uh, two scrambled eggs, hash browns, patty sausage, and it was probably the worst breakfast I have ever had in my whole life. I would I won't have to come outside and lick my butt to get the taste out of my mouth. Anyway, enough of that crap. I'm fixing to head up the uh, Highway 128 along the Colorado River, and I am heading out into an area of the country to where when it opens up into the uh, high plateau, I guess you call it, it's probably the loneliest place in the world. Last year when I came through here, I stopped out there, stopped right in the middle of the road, had lunch, and not a soul, not a sound, anything. It's the uh, only place in the whole world I've traveled to that I can truly say that I felt totally alone. Felt good in a way, though. Anyway, I will give you a report later on. You guys have a good day. Goodbye.
Well, I'm traveling along Route 128 along the, the Colorado River. I'm heading north up towards uh, I-70. This road here is a road that leads to a, uh, a place called Onion Creek. It was in the uh, Utah Backcountry Discovery Route uh, documentary. I stopped here to take a picture of the access road. It's really, really beautiful out here. And if you can see it, in the distance, there's a nice mountain with some snow on it. But I am going to head on down the road. The sun's probably shining into the camera here. On down there. There's not a breath of wind. Not a sound except for the river rapids. Crystal clear skies. The temperature is about 75 degrees. It just doesn't get any better than this. I'm at a little, uh, what used to be a town called Cisco, right off this little 14 foot wide unmarked blacktop road. I guess the town was blown away a number of years ago by a tornado and everybody just left. They're, they left a bunch of cars still there. Everything is just like it was. It's just totally abandoned. This is a picture for Mama. I know she wants to see something like this.
I am now in the middle of N-O-T-H-I-N-G. Nothing. There is nothing here. No people. No McDonald's. No Walmart. I don't know where I am. I think I-70 is up ahead. Anyway, I think I'll lay down in the middle of the road and take a nap. Goodbye. Okay, I'm awake now. I'm bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. Just like that prairie dog I tried to run over. Because a bunch of them tried to ambush me back there by throwing a tumbleweed at me. If I had my gun out, I'd have shot the little bastards. Anyway, that's where I'm going. If I ran out of gas out here, nobody would find me for about six years.
Well, I'm on Highway 141 in Colorado, southbound towards Ridgeway. It's hot. I stopped to take a break. I'm having me a Cliff Bar peanut butter and, I don't know, all kind of healthy stuff in it, I guess. Alongside the road in the canyon here. It is really pretty. Very desolate, though. It follows a river over there. <clears throat> Motorbike is running absolutely perfect. So am I. Well, almost. I'm hungry, but I'm not going to eat at a fancy restaurant. I'm going to find me a Burger King after my Cliff Bar. Goodbye.
This is the beginning of a little road called the Dead Road. It runs from uh, Ure over towards Telluride. It's really beautiful. I went a few miles up it and then turned around and came back because I was, uh, it was getting late and I was heading for the campground. There are some flowers for Mama. <laughs>